I'm John with Rockland Technologies, and today we're going to show you three ways to determine if the Wi-Fi networks around you are 2.4 or 5 gigahertz. This is important to know because starting in 2021, certain public hotspots such as Xfinity are going to be switching over to the 5 gigahertz network bands only. This means if you have an older 2.4 gigahertz only product, you will not be able to connect. So if you already have a dual band product such as this or the new dual band Alpha Camp Pro systems, you will also want to connect to the five gigahertz networks when possible to get the best speeds and throughput. So today we're going to start showing you how to do this on a Microsoft Windows 10 computer. On your Windows 10 computer, click the Wi-Fi icon located in the bottom right. If you're connected, you will see the network you're connected to. Go ahead and click on properties. Once this page opens, it will show you at the bottom, the network band, which is 2.4 gigahertz, and the network channel, which in this case is 11. Now, if we want to see if there are any five gigahertz networks available around us, go back to our Wi-Fi icon and connect to a network that you think might be five gigahertz. Ours is labeled 5G, but just to double check, we're going to connect, click on properties again, scroll down, and check to see what our network band is is 5 gigahertz. Our channel is also 149. In North America, any channel greater than 11 is going to be a 5 gigahertz network. Now, if you'd like to find out if your networks around you are 2.4 or 5 gigahertz, and you do not want to connect to them, open an internet browser and type in Wi-Fi Info View. Search and the first result should take you to a website called nearsoft.net. Click this website and scroll all the way to the bottom. You'll see a link that says download Wi-Fi info view. Click on it. And once it's finished downloading, click the file in the bottom left. Now click Wi-Fi info view, extract all, click extract. And now you can double click on the application. Once it opens, you'll be able to see a list of all the networks around you. The frequency is listed as well as the channel. Again, in North America, if the channel is greater than 11, you know that the network is five gigahertz. If you have an Android phone, there is an app called Wi-Fi Analyzer that will help you determine if your network is 2.4 or five gigahertz. In the Google Play Store, we will search for Wi-Fi Analyzer. Tap it. And then tap Install. Tap Accept. Wait for the program to be installed. Then tap Open. We will need to change from the graph to the access points icon and all the 2.4 gigahertz networks will be listed. We can tap the 5 gigahertz icon to see all of the 5 gigahertz networks. And if you have an iPhone, there's an app called Airport Utility that we can show you how to use to determine if your network is 2.4 or 5 gigahertz. On your iPhone, go to the app store and search for Airport Utility. If you have not already, go ahead and download the app. Once the app is downloaded, tap Open. You'll notice there is no Wi-Fi scan icon in the top right. So we need to go back to our settings, scroll down until we see the Airport Utility app, tap it, and where it says Wi-Fi scanner, tap this to on. Now let's go back to the Airport Utility app. We'll notice that we can now click Wi-Fi scan in the top right, and then we can click scan. A list of all the networks will appear on this page, and you will be able to see based on the channel whether or not the network is 2.4 or 5 gigahertz. In America, all channels 1 through 11 are 2.4 gigahertz. Anything greater than 11 will be 5 gigahertz. 
So there you have it. If you're in need of a new dual band Wi-Fi product, visit us at rockland.com and be sure to check out all of our other YouTube videos. Thank you.